Titans, it's me, Mrs. Pasak, your principal. This video is intended to help you on your first few days of school. So, hopefully you'll learn where to come in, what happens at lunch, what the bathrooms look like and what that situation is, and what to do at recess. We hope you have a great year, River Place Titans, and we'll see you on Tuesday. Ms. Warren and Ms. Braun show us how a car rider would be dropped off by her mom in the morning. Oh, mom, you know what? We can actually help get her out of the car. That's oh, just awesome. Thank okay. you. Bye. Good morning, Ms. Lassa. Oh, and I have Ms. Ashley. I tell you what, let's go ahead and get back in the car and let's get out on this side where it's safe. That's a very good idea. Oh, and I like that you have your mask on. Come on in, it's so good to have, have you. Have a good day. Bye, Bye Mom. Mom. Bye. Okay, Titans, if you are a bus rider, this is where your bus will come in every morning when it brings you to school. They will come down this drive on the side of our school and they will pull you up right under this covered area. So even if it's raining, you won't get wet. So your bus will stop and they will open the doors and they will let you off. And you're gonna walk on this sidewalk and one of the first people you're gonna see every morning is Mrs. Garcia. She checks off all of our bus riders as they get to school. And then you'll come around the corner here and you'll see another teacher to greet you. This is Mrs. Simpson. She is one of the bus rider escorts. Here's a sign, Titans, to help you remember what doors you're gonna go in. Once we get inside, Titans, one of our wonderful teachers will lead you down our hallway to make sure that you get to your classroom on time. So as you can see, we have these yellow dots to help you remember how far to stay away from the person in front of you so that we can keep our distance. One of these wonderful teachers will walk you all the way to your classroom until you find your teacher. As you walk down the hall, you're going to get to your classroom where your teacher's going to be waiting at the door to greet you. Good morning! And they're going to spray your hands with some hand sanitizer. Then you're going to take your backpack and you're going to find your seat in your classroom and you are going to put your backpack at your seat or wherever your teacher directs you to do so. Titans, throughout the school day, you might need to go to the restroom. So you will follow your teacher's classroom procedure for leaving your desk area and sanitizing your hands with the hand sanitizer before leaving your classroom to go to the restroom. Rooms. There is a side for our boys and there is a side for our girls. As you can see at the restrooms, there is a sign that helps us remember that we need to keep our distance from other people. As you go into the restroom, Titans, the areas that are okay to use are marked with yellow dots. The other ones that we would like you to not use the doors are locked and they have a sign like this. That means please don't use these at this time. So if you see a yellow dot and the door is open, you are good to go in. If you see a yellow dot and the door is locked, that means somebody is in there and you need to wait. So we're gonna go back outside of the restroom and there's gonna be a spot right here for you to put your feet on and wait your turn until somebody comes out. When we're done using the restroom tank, we wanna make sure that we wash our hands good. 
So as you can see at our sink, there is one yellow dot so that one person can come to the sink and wash their hands at a time. You will dry your hands, put your paper towels in the trash, and you can walk back to your class. Titans, please remember that we can't use our water fountains right now. We can use our bottle filler stations. So please remember to bring a water bottle so that you can drink water and stay hydrated throughout the day. Titans, we're gonna show you how to walk down the hall and look how your teachers are all spread apart. That's exactly what we wanna see. And now they're gonna walk down the hall and they're gonna show you how they still stay apart. And that is called social distancing. I bet you've heard about that. And then when they get ready to stop, they're gonna find a dot to stand on. Time for lunch. Put out your hands. You gotta sanitize. So Mrs. Hadley is here and she is our kindergarten lunch duty person. She'll be on lunch duty with another kindergarten teacher every time. We have Miss Short, Mrs. House, and Miss Wade here to show you how to do lunch at River Place Elementary. When you come in, you'll notice that our tables are socially distanced and there are dots for where you should sit. There are also dots along the way so that you can make your way to the lunch line. All right, who's going down the lunch line? Make your way. Mrs. Wade, didn't you bring your lunch? I brought my lunch today. Okay, instead of the lunch line, you're going to go straight to your seat. Do you remember which one? 22. 22. Go to your seat. All right. You notice our others are heading down to the lunch line, and they are staying at least six feet apart using the dots to help them. When Mrs. Schwartz gets to the front of the line, she's going to wait on the last dot until it's her turn. Oops, it looks like it's your turn. So she will go on in and first stop is order your drink, milk, strawberry or chocolate. All right, then you'll move along and order your food. You're gonna keep your hands behind your back and the lunch ladies will help build your tray. Once your tray is done, they will slide it over to you and you will move over and pay. You'll hand them your lunch card with your name and your ID number that we provide for you and you'll leave it there and head on over to your seat. Mrs. Schwartz, I think you're number 13. Do you remember where your seat is? Oh, I see it. All right, we stay in our seats. And once you're seated, you can remove your mask and have your lunch. Once our lunches are done, we put our masks back on, clear our tables, clear our lunch trays, and we sanitize our hands again before we leave. Have a great lunch, Titans. If you forget something very important that you have to have for that day, then it's okay. Your parent can bring it up to the school to you. They will first need to go through the scanner and fill out the information. They will need to bring it to the front office in a bag with your name and your teacher's name. And then the front office will take care of getting it to your classroom. dismissal time titans this year students will stay in their classrooms during dismissal so that we can maintain social distancing during this busy time a staggered dismissal system will be used students will be called based on their mode of transportation and be led by a staff member to the area where their transportation will be waiting miss Lynn, your car is here just make sure and sanitize you before you leave. Do you have everything? I do. Okay, just make sure. There you go. Thank you. All together. Come on, let's go ahead. I'm going to set this deal. Okay. That way for your neck, that's it for your friends. Come on, let's go back ahead and get in your car. Okay. They're out your way.
sanitizer and spray your hands. Come on up and we'll sanitize your hands. Nice. Okay, come on out. Let's sanitize your hands before you go outside, please. Oh, Thank nice. you. Thank you. Okay, Titans, when you go outside, you do still need to wear your mask. We do have a spot when you're outside at recess that you can take a quick break and then put your mask back on. But we can only have one person in the break place at a time, so we will have to take turns. Okay, Titans, that's it. Your teachers have been up here working and we're all ready for, to see you guys on Tuesday. We're so excited. <laughs>